Hey there, people. Well, it's been a while. Uh, well, I'm feeling a bit better. Hopefully you guys are feeling cool. Anyway, as you can see behind me, the Ford's empty. I'm not liking that. So, let's go get some scrap. Well, today's my area's garbage day, so good thing is I don't have to drive too far, so hopefully you can pick up some scrap. I got a kind of a grocery list here, a shopping list to do. Um, a couple of local YouTubers are looking for some stuff. Uh, short sleeve. He's looking for uh, some windows for his ice hut that open. And I think I already got those, so we'll go look at those later. Fuck! Forgot my measuring tape, buddy. Then we got Y2K XJ. He's looking for a fireplace insert. Working or not. I guess he bought a house and uh, and they took the fireplace when they moved out. So now he's got an open hole and he wants to fill it. So yeah, let's go get some shit. Well, we just started scrapping and then already I'm in a hole. Gotta get some gas. Some gas, yes, yes. Well, I was just about to leave, but I thought I'd show you the cuddlers. What you guys doing? Cuddling? It's the boys. Lead singer from Black Friday. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Well, Beaver Kyle here. He just gave me some really bad news. You guys remember Beaver Bird from my past videos? Oh. Okay, you gotta tell them. Beaver Bird passed away, guys. Can you friggin' believe that, boys? Beaver Bird. Yeah. So they just found him dead in his apartment. That really sucks. Yeah, uh, I guess he got drunk and passed out or whatever on his back or something. And... Yeah. Well, this is Beaver Kyle, by the way. That's sad to hear about Beaver Bird. Like, I didn't know him very well, but he was always happy to see us. And... Yeah. Oh, well. Rest in peace, Beaver Bird. Yeah. We'll have a beer for him. Okay, Kyle. Okay, see you later. Have a good day, buddy. Yeah, you too. Well, that really sucks about Beaver Burt, man. Like I said, I barely knew the guy. I just freaking gave him a ride to work, uh, what was it, three weeks ago? He was running late, he was all hungover. Like, the guy was, I bet you, not even 45 or 25 years old. Just ruined my fucking day. Beaver Burt is dead. The beginning of my scrap run will begin at Tim Hortons. Starting on my street anyway. Grab a coffee and we'll go up this way. Can I get a small iced cappuccino with a shot of butter caramel, please? Thank you. Nope. Thank you. Thank you. You too, take care. All right, street number one. All righty, street number one paid off already. Didn't even have a drink of my coffee yet. Let's give her. Well, there's piece number one. She said it works fine, but scrap it. Okay, I gotta have a drink of my coffee. Well, that really, really, really sucks. Had a sip of my coffee and fucking son of a bitch did. See that there? It's never a good sign. That means somebody's already been through this neighborhood. Two fridge doors. Oh, drawers. Oh, there you go, short sleeve. This guy's got two windows. They do open. I didn't bring my measuring tape, but uh, that's how thick the frame is. They're both the same size. I don't know, buddy, if you want them, I can get them. 60 by 120. It's gotta be, what, 8, 10 inches thick, wide? Yeah, let me know, buddy. Yep.
Ага. Well, that was almost a waste of time. I hate that when somebody beats me to my run, you know. As soon as I seen those two drawers from that fridge, I knew it was all over. But anyway, it was still nice to get out. It was a beautiful day, so right on. Yeah, I got home and there's this package in the mail for me. Look at all the stamps on that sucker. It's from Alberta. Blaine. So we'll get this opened up and see what's inside. Well, we got her opened up. First thing that come out was Temptations for the kitty cats. Kitty cats love this stuff. Right on. There's a letter. It's from Blaine. Tired trucker for life. Tired trucker for life. I'll leave his link below. Check him out. But anyway, I'll read you the letter. Hey Marcel. It's been great to see you back on the road again after two weeks ordeal with the painful fingers and all. The goof doctors. Yeah, really. However, I was devastated, and I'm sure I'm not alone in this, that you couldn't invite us in for a beer at the end of the day. That's your trademark, man. LOL. Well, we're having a beer right now, buddy. Cheers to you, Blaine. That being said, please allow me to make a small contribu contribution to the Molson Canadian Fund to hopefully help prevent a similar tragedy from happening again. Please proceed imme immediately to the beer store. Shit, I've already been. I've also enclosed a bag of treats for all the kitties too. Our cats go nuts over these things. Please continue to be positive and I wish you and Shelly the very best for the future. Right on Blaine, you're the man. As if you did that. Buddy sends me 40 bucks like, shouldn't have done that man. Well. You know where I'm spending that tomorrow, that's for sure. To the beer store. Right on. Yeah, on a less positive note, that was pretty sad to hear about uh, Beaver Burt, man. That really sucks. I was just getting to know the guy. Like, like I said, I gave him a ride to work, what, three weeks ago. He scored himself a great job with Mansour Mining here in Sudbury. He's starting to make big bucks there. I don't know, we were supposed to get together for some beers and now I hear he passed away, like, cheers to you. I already miss you, Beaver Bert. Rock on wherever you are, buddy. Well, anyway, people, thanks for watching. Later. Well, short sleeve, you've seen those windows I found there? Uh, you can have them if you want them. They're 60 centimeters by 120 centimeters. Uh, the frame's probably 8 inches thick, I'm guessing. But anyway, if you want them, let me know, man. Uh, you guys have to check out Short Sleeve's channel. I'll link. I'll leave his link down below there. Uh, he does uh, snowmobiling, uh, quadding, is a quad net. So yeah, check him out. Hey, dude. Hey, man. Uh, can I get 59 cents worth? No camera today. It's on on you right now, oh, buddy. There it is. You're a movie star. So, 59 cents. Like a seven minute clip star. <laughs> How much you want? Ten, ten bucks? Ten bucks. No, why do you think ten? <laughs> I said 56, 56 cents. Are you fucking retarded or something? No. I'm hyper. <laughs> I just scored a big load of metal. I'll be right back. Hey! What's up? Be right back! <laughs> I guess I'll be That's, right back see? right now because the fucking breather's all full of dirt. Yeah, you should try to come later in the day. I could shoot the shit with you for a little longer. You always come when it's fucking peak hours. I'm on a schedule, buddy. Fuck off. You make your own schedule, don't you? <laughs> yes. When's the best time to go scrap and early in the morning? Well, right now it's been awesome when they call me. Oh, yeah, you got a lot of people. You just give your name and say a holler for free for them yeah, and shit, eh? that's where we're going right now. Some chicken uh, lively called me. She's well, when some you metal. first started up, just, you know, fucking testing your luck out on the streets. When's the best time to do it? First thing in the morning? No. No, late at night? When people get home from work, they put their garbage out. So garbage nights. You got a truck? You should, I shouldn't tell you to get into it. Forget it. No, why? <laughs> There's too much competition out there. Fuck, I know so many people, dude, that just straight up steal copper right off the fucking railway lines. I know. Like, I have buddies that are, like, good at it. Like, they have, like, a little system down and everything. 
like you know the wire cutters bolt cutters they're not very long you know what i mean they're only like, what two feet long they just walk the trucks kind of thing well they get fucking they get two fucking 10 foot like uh aluminum pipes so i don't know what kind of metal they were but you know hollow pipes put the handles in there you got great big fucking helpers yeah yeah and then they drop they just go and they drop what like every and fucking like see how there's distance in between the poles yeah they call that a set and each set has three copper wires so off each set you get like 30 bucks man you gotta have if, balls yeah because they get it's the good <coughs> copper you know the one they pay more for oh yeah a grade or whatever number one yeah and they got you gotta burn it no, so. i don't i don't steal that's one thing i don't do. no fuck it's not worth it no that's why i said fuck i got dumb buddies that do it like i'm me i'm just a weed guy all my friends they're all fucking <laughs> small town hey eh? that's what happened you stay there too long fuck turn into something you don't want to be all right right on <laughs> bert later man the chick behind is annoyed like she was done pumping a long time ago and he still wants to talk. Gotta like the beaver bird. This is good shit.